Today on Softball 360, round two of the Stadium Power Tour lands along the banks of the Ohio River, home of the Reds. Discover why Cincinnati is also a big time softball town. Team Easton's Brian Wegman lives here and shares a slice of Cincy. Check out Big League Dreams, a softball theme park with amazing replicas of classic MLB yards. Later, a preview of the WSL Worth North American Championships from sunny Panama Beach, Florida. Reporter Greer Howard has the latest news and shows your team what to expect. I'm not going anywhere, and you shouldn't either. We got more to come. And we'll get mic'd up on the Stadium Power Tour. <laughs> Crank it up to 11. Softball 360 starts right now. show dedicated to the sport of softball. And hello again, everybody. Welcome to Softball 360. Dave Benz alongside Timmy Layton. You are in tune to the best show in America revolving around the sport of softball. Now, last week, the Stadium Power Tour got underway in San Diego. This week, it switches to Cincinnati, home to the Great American Ballpark. Timmy, there have been some fantastic battles waged in the Stadium Power Tour in that yard. And of course, it only makes sense because it is a great softball community located right on the banks of the Ohio River. Always a popular stop on the Stadium Power Tour, it's softball country. And it's probably the favorite stop for one of the chief players on the Stadium Power Tour. I'm talking about Brian, the ball will be flying Wegman. He hails from the city of Cincinnati and he loves going back to the Great American Ballpark. The Reds make it easy to dress for success in Cincinnati. Yep, Cincinnati Red Stockings, Red Legs. Great American Ballpark receives solid reviews and has become the centerpiece to a revitalized riverfront. Attached to the park, the Reds Baseball Hall of Fame. A dream come true to those who treasure the early days from the Red Stockings, to Sparky and the Big Red Machine, to newly elected Hall of Famer Barry Larkin. Kings of the Queen City, this is also big time softball country. Fans arrive early to the park on this day they meet, mix, and mingle with their home run heroes on the Stadium Power Tour. News of the game, things happening around the ballpark. We're in the fan zone for the Long Haul Bombers. You're here, you saw them before the game. Now they're the world's greatest softball home run hitters. 500 feet, they can hit it and maybe, I hear one might have even found it. Team Easton's Brian Wegman grew up here and calls Cincy home. Weggs has plenty of pride and admits feeling a bit anxious about hitting before his hometown fans and family. It's always a little added pressure um, because my buddies won't let me live it down if I really stink it up. Because the, the adrenaline can get the best of you. You can get the shakes, you can get the wobbles. Um, it can be a little overwhelming. Uh, but as far as the consistency, uh, a lot of it is how you use that adrenaline and carry it over into your swing each swing, every swing, nobody wants to get booed. That negative adrenaline can take over if you start off bad. Weggs has logged five years on the Stadium Power Tour and along the way earned league-wide props and praise. At this point, Weggs is a veteran of the tour. Same deal, he's level-headed, he's calm out there. He's in, he, has, he brings a great intensity and uh, consistency, you know? He, he's, he's capable of hitting a, a 500 plus foot shot and that, that, makes them, uh, that makes them get on their feet at the stadiums. Pound for pound, probably one of the best players in the country and a uh, great guy, very humble and willing to help the younger guys. And I think that's what I like so much about them. Raw talent. Wegman has both sides of the game. I mean, he can play defense, he can, you know, obviously hit it plenty far. Uh, he is also another one that just puts in effort and time. Team Easton won the coveted Manufacturers Cup last year, and the road to a repeat starts right here in Cincy. They like their chances as much as their Easton gear. Uh, tested and proven, out of the wrapper better. And uh, the Easton durability is still there, so you're getting exactly what you want. The raw power line of bats, they're the real deal. Here's a 
fun fact about Weggs. His brother Bill played for the Milwaukee Brewers for a decade. Yeah, well, no doubt I remember him suiting up for the Brew Crew back in the day, as I'm sure many of our viewers do. Now, of course, this is just the second stop on this year's stadium power tour from Cincinnati. The power tour will head to St. Petersburg for a show at the Trop. A big Friday night then follows in Texas at the ballpark in Arlington, followed by shows in Atlanta, Detroit, Houston, St. Louis, Seattle, Minnesota, New York, and Miami. And the finals this year, where it all wraps up, will be a special Friday night, August 23rd, in St. Paul, Minnesota at Midway Stadium. You know what, Dave? Now it's time for my favorite part of the sport, the women's fast pit. You mean a little rock and fire? You got some rock and fire Maybe in Maybe just a little bit, but I think they can bring a little bit more. It's a little bit more natural than an overhand pitch, but let's see what they have to offer. Rock and fire is a phrase these ladies live by. They're taking the sport of fast pitch to the next generation at weekend clinics that bring all the elements together. Taryn Mowat was an All-American at the University of Arizona, a legendary righty who once struck out 18 players in a game and threw two no-hitters. Because, I mean, all of us were young at once. All of us looked up to somebody at one time in our lives. Now I'm in the role that I get to be the one trying to kind of um, pave the way for younger girls to be in our position. And for the kids at the clinic, learning from the greats of the game may be the best part of the weekend. I love it for the fun of the game, and I get to play anywhere. Stride, stride, stride. Still ahead, take a tour of Big League Dream, a theme park for classic MLB yards. Just what else would you expect in Vegas? The best teams are headed to Panama City Beach, and Greer previews some of the matchups. Time to pack your bags for a softball 360 road across America. Softball 360 is brought to you by Easton Sports. There is a difference, and the difference is Easton. By Mike and Sports, elite equipment for the elite player. Mike and Sports by bpathletics.com. When you want the best in quality, service, and price, log on to bpathletics.com. And by softballcenter.com, the site for major softball news. 